good afternoon to everybody present so i am uh, mukta patwardhan i am a dental student studying in uh, uh, rajarajeshwari dental college bangalore uh, so i am going to talk about uh, advanced technology as future of forensic uh, forensic dentistry has developed into a important component of forensic science it plays a crucial role in identifying people who have died in mass disaster or crimes and those that can't be identified visually or by any other means digital forensic can be identified as application of computer science and investigative techniques for legal purpose involving analysis and digital in analysis of digital evidence um so uh, in the changing world where uh, going digital has become a way of life life i would like to shed some light on the advanced technologies and the importance of digitization uh, um in forensic so i'd like to start with the digital forensic radiography and digital photography uh, so we all know photography is the best method to collect and preserve evidence in uh, in especially cases where there is a, a human abuse or bite mark um digital photography uh, where previously light was used yes it uh, enhances uh, the features on the skin such as uh, reflection absorption and the uh, diffusion of the skin but recent advances where non visible light is used uh, the infrared or ultraviolet light is used it is helpful in identifying subdermal hemorrhage and even the use of fluorescent uh, uh, photography it uh, highlights the injured tissue even though it appears normal with the visible light uh, coming to digital forensic radiography uh, it it is very uh, immediate and uh, it is very rapid in nature and uh, helps us to immediately uh, compare the antemortem and uh, postmortem radiograph and easy transfer of data coming to intraoral uh, 3d optical scanners uh, laser and optical sensors are used and it's very reliable uh, rapid and non invasive it eliminates the use of impression trace or impression material and uh, decreases the discomfort it is uh, used as a adjunct with the computer assisted overlays in bite mark analysis where uh, previously uh, the method was to take impression and then trace the um, biting edges from on a acetate uh, sheet with the marker manually but in this process uh, the cast is scanned uh, on the glass surface of the scanner and uh, with the help of a, so a software the biting edges are uh, um, selected and overlay is made this overlay uh, generated uh helps in easy comparison uh, with the suspect and the bite mark uh, retrieve it also reduces the chances of manipulation and error so coming to computerized facial reconstruction and 3d printing uh it is very helpful in identifying uh, in cases where body is uh, uh immensely mutilated uh, beyond recognition and any other method can't be used uh so skull based on the skull features and the use of uh, virtual skull uh, sculpting systems uh it of uh, uh, the face can be reconstructed and also printed so it decrent recreates multiple images of the same face efficiently and provides re realistic facial uh, appearance uh, sim uh, simulating many photographs so it's very rapid and very uh, efficient are uh, talking about uh, virtual autopsy or digital autopsy or vultopsy um in this uh, in the wake of the pandemic we have all realized uh, the scalpel autopsy is like very uh, risky so uh, as uh, uh, dr rakhi ma'am yesterday very nicely uh, uh, explained to us and uh, it uses ct or mri or uh, mr microscopy and it's very non invasive and uh, and it takes lesser time so it uh, helps to identify internal fractures and soft tissue damage and the data can be stored and can be used later on uh, and it is not in influenced by any individual perception and it is also helpful in acquiring data of, from the regions which is generally uh, difficult to reach in a, a scalpel autopsy or the conventional autopsy and it can the data, uh, the region can be viewed by a different angles also it also helps in um, uh guided biopsy techniques to obtain uh, samples from urine bile or blood uh, for toxicology and dna investigation uh coming to forensic bio robots it's uh, uh, it has been in its initial uh, studies but it has proved uh, 
important and useful for uh, automation of DNA sampling and the process that involves extraction, quantification, and dilution. It saves times and reduce, uh, reduces human error while it improves the efficiency and enables the doctor or the scientist to focus on the focus on an analysis uh, focus on the analysis and interpretation rather than the processing task coming to magnetic resonance spectrometry uh, it uh, it can be helped to determine uh, relative concentration of metabolites and uh, toxic can be uh, examined uh, without uh, contamination uh, it increases the uh, sensitivity and specificity and uh, uh, with uh, also i would like to conclude by saying that uh, advanced technology is faster more accurate and error free with ease of uh, digital picture transfer and without loss of information and it can be modified by third party these technologies uh, will be especially useful uh, because it's rapid when uh, uh, in case of uh, majorly in case of there are multiple bodies such as uh, disaster victims and with upgradation of software and implementation uh, everywhere it is safe to say that uh, advanced technology and digitization is the uh, future of forensics thank you i would also like to thank uh, iasr for this opportunity and my guide uh, dr savita ma'am for guiding me through this poster thank you